genital area hygiene and vulval care. Vulvar and vaginal hygiene. Vaginal and genital area is a sensitive and important area. Strong sense of femininity and satisfying sexuality. Good hygiene gives more confidence. In order for the woman to be able to examine the vulva, she must crouch and use a mirror. Disturbances that are often a source of concern. A strange feeling of an abnormal form of, of her vulva and embarrassment during sex can cause denial of sexual intercourse. A feeling of unpleasant smell. Abnormal, large or small labia that may be corrected surgically. Best hair removal method. Laser waxing or shaving. Each woman must be sure that she has a normal area just like any other woman but with minor differences that makes her unique and special. It is strong, recommended to consult your doctor if you feel some itching, irritation or rash at vulvar area. Vaginal discharge is very common and must often is, it is physiological and caused by hormonal changes. The skin of the genital area is very sensitive and therefore requires a good daily hygiene to achieve maximum comfort and enjoyment during sex. The use of vegetable oils to moisturize and soothe the vulva would be very beneficial providing more comfort and flexibility especially after menopause. <coughs> Pubic hair removal. Different ways for taking care and removal of this hair which depends on the type of skin and what each woman prefers. She may prefer to remove all the hair from the whole area. She can remove it from certain parts only. Trimming for permanent hair removal. Laser can be done. With this method, there will be no irritation or hair growing under the skin, but be very careful in choosing the right place for the specialized clinic or center. Whatever the method chosen, it is advisable to start on a small area because avoid allergic skin reaction, burn from hot wax, lacerations caused by shaving. In cases of active inflammation such as herpes or blisters, it is recommended to trim the hair to prevent the spread of inflammation. Tips for using laundry products. Cleansers and products that do not contain dyes or enzymes and perfumes should be only used in cleaning underwear, sportswear, towels, and sleepwear. Use half or third the suggested amount of laundry products to minimize its concentration. Avoid the use of soothing clothes. If you use products to remove stains, rinse underwear in warm water before washing again. How to choose the right underwear? Choose a good quality cotton fabric that absorbs the moisture and dries quickly. If your skin is sensitive or you have the rash use, appropriate clothing and pants. It is better to avoid wearing underwear and pants during the night. It is more appropriate to use pajamas or even sleep naked. Underwears and clothes should be changed immediately when they get wet after exercise or swimming. How to treat wet and dry vulval area? Some women are suffering from chronic vulval disease and Using talc powder is a common mistake as it causes irritation and may lead to contact dermatitis. Moreover, it has carcinogenic potential. For women complaining of persistent wet vulva, the best prevention is by wearing cotton underwear that dry quickly and also using natural moisturizers and oils. It is preferred to keep extra pair of underwear in a small bag or purse for regular change if the underwear became wet at the workplace or at school. After exercise or making extra effort, immediate change of wet underwear is recommended. It is advisable not to wear daily use pads. Tampons are safe to use but the frequent use or when the amount of bleeding is not much, tampons become harmful, causing irritation of the vulva, increase in vaginal secretions and thereby releasing an unpleasant odor. Which hygiene and shower products to use? Avoid using products that can cause irritation of the skin or the genital area such as the liquid soap and scented lotions. Though they have pleasant smell, they can cause irritation. Avoid douching, which causes irritation by interfering with the bacteria naturally present at the vulvar area and contribute in its protection. If you have sensitive skin, cleaning the area with warm water and gently rubbing with hand is enough to keep the area clean without causing irritation. Try to change the type of soap used because you might be allergic to a particular type of soap. Usually organic soap and natural products are preferred. Avoid bath bubbles, bath salts, baths with scented oils if you have sensitive skin. If you have irritation, wipe the area gently by pressing and avoid rubbing with the towel. How to treat vulvar itching? If you suddenly started to complain from itching, it was associated with whitish vaginal discharge that is most likely due to fungal infection. Local treatment with antifungal cream and ovules would be sufficient. 
Warm sits bath can help to reduce the itching. 4 to 5 tablespoons of baking soda can be added to the bath 1 to 3 times daily for 10 to 15 minutes each time. If no improvement with local antifungal or if it was associated with skin rash, the cause might be a typical fungus that needs specific treatment. The use of wet bandages can relieve irritation. Tips for cleaning the genital area After going to toilet, use smooth, white and unscented toilet paper. Avoid wet napkins. Wash the area with warm water after urination. After duplication, it is important to wipe the genital area from front to back, not the opposite. If you are using daily pads, it is recommended to change every 6 to 8 hours. Frequent use of tampons can increase your chance of having vaginal and vulval infection. What are the best moisturizers for the vulvar skin? The best moisturizer is natural oils, sesame oil, sunflower oil, canola oil, or jojoba oil. Natural vegetable oils are clean, cheap, and free of chemicals. Use only small amounts of these oils to avoid staining your underwear. These oils are the best lubricant before intercourse. Some considerations for sex. It should be free of pain, and here are some instructions to avoid vulvar irritation, injury, or having burning sensation. Use natural oils as lubricant. The use of vegetable oils during foreplay for more excitement and enjoyment help lubricate the genital organs of both partners before initiating the vaginal intercourse and it reduces friction and pain in the vagina, urethra and clitoris. Avoid using latex condoms with natural oils because it can be melted but it is safe with the aventitide. If you are menopause, using sunflower oil is a must because it can give you prolonged miniaturization and prevent cracks and laceration at the vagina. Avoid synthetic lubricants containing water such as KY jelly because it dries during intercourse and results in more dryness. It also contains chemicals and preservatives that can cause irritation. Avoid sex when there is a vaginal infection. They use of male condoms to prevent the spread of infection. In case of painful sex, it is strongly recommended to consult the doctor if you have pain during intercourse, including vulval vestibule. This may be due to vulvodynia is a very common defect that can cause pain to the age of menopause. And for better treatment, consult your doctor if you feel pain during the intercourse. It is advisable to urinate just after intercourse to prevent bladder inflammation. To get world class in fertility, IVF, gynecology, and obstetrics facilities, visit us at www.layus.com.